What's going on, guys? It's Nick from Live It Outdoors. My wrist is still sprained. So I decided to come out here to Thor today and just have a little fun. Picked this up yesterday. Ruger Mark IV 22 light. And so I threw my half by 28 uh, piston in my suppressor. I'm going to shoot it a little bit today. Suppressed and unsuppressed. I'll probably start out unsuppressed. Just plank around, have some fun, and then I'll suppress it. So I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get up over those sights with that size of it because it's a 45 can. And uh, so whenever you look at it, I don't know. I haven't had it on there. Actually, I think I might be able to actually get up over the sights. But anyway, we're going to try it out. We're going to shoot it today, have some fun. I'm going to try to clink some steel. Uh, had a comment one time asking me, uh, if I could get pointers on how to uh, shoot better long distance and and faster and it's all about trigger control uh, I've shot probably close to 100 150 200,000 rounds through 22s through the years my mom and dad and I used to go out every Sunday and we'd each take a brick and we'd just shoot 22 pistols until all of our bricks were gone and uh, did that over and over and over and over again through the years. And it was just a blast, you know, just the three of us getting out and having fun doing it. And uh, it's all about trigger control and not anticipating recoil. Uh, just keep your hands straight. And this style pistol is how I began to do that. So I'm not bragging on shooting long distance. I'm not bragging on shooting fast. Uh, I was just, that comment was thrown out. So I just figured I'd let you know, but uh best thing i can suggest is just get you a 22 pistol and just shoot the piss out of it i'm gonna get to shoot and have some fun gordon let's have some fun i have not shot this i hope it cycles i hope the sights are on because i don't know let's see my headset's not on so i'm probably talking loud well, this dude's light, man. This would be good to carry up and down the creek, smoke water moccasins with. It's a little bit off, I think. Well, I think cycle's good. <laughs> I like this little gun. Boy, that thing just stole my pack going up a creek. Let's see what we got here. Let's see, six o'clock hole, looks like it's shooting a little bit to the left. I need a red dot on this thing. I can go to town with a red dot on this thing. Oh yeah, that's slick. And I'm not used to a black front sight, but let me tell you guys, this thing's a freaking blast to shoot. It's been a while since I've shot a 22 pistol. And whenever I saw this, I thought, man, you know, I thought this, this would be fun. Just to go out, plank around, have some fun. Not necessarily, I'm not trying to do a review or anything on it. Uh, it's just, I'm out here to have fun. So I figured I'd make a video too. <laughs> That's bad. Let's shoot some with a can on it. Let's see what we can do here. Have a little fun. Put that there. Put this bad boy on here. <laughs> that looks so wicked. I don't know. That's that's gonna be a good thumbnail right there. All right, let's see what supersonic sound like suppressed out of a 45 can. That's a pretty nice little setup. 
doesn't add a whole lot of weight to it. I'm curious. See how this is going to run. Yeah, I got the size. That's decent. That's that's very decent. Let's try uh, let's try some of these. These are standard velocity. This is what I used to shoot in uh, competition, small bore silhouette back in the day. We we'll go a little standard velocity. We'll just shoot that back burn. And see how much more quiet this is. functioning very good. <laughs> That's pretty quiet when you shoot that back burn. I'll shoot kind of over here in that angle where there's not much mud and see if we can tell a big difference. Alright, that's first five. There's a difference. Not a whole lot, really. How's it going, buddy? Pretty decent. Looks like we're working with about the same things today. There you go. All right, there you go, buddy. I just picked this one up yesterday. I used to have a bunch of Mark IIs and Mark Threes, and I haven't bought one of their Mark IVs, and I saw this one, I thought, you know, I'm just gonna go ahead and pick me one up. It's actually a, a Gym Tech Lunar for 45, but yeah. I've got a, a half by 28 piston in it. It's running pretty decent. What one? Oh, yeah? yeah? Does it work pretty good? Oh, yeah. It's 22 only. Yeah. But it's modular. There you go. Each oh, one yeah, of okay. these little pieces makes it longer or shorter. Shoot, yeah. <laughs> Heck yeah. Yeah, on this Lunar, you can take off the last two baffles and just have it that short, yeah. but I mean, it's that's about it on yeah, that Yeah, literally one. this one you can take off from about here. That's pretty cool. To all here. Shoot, yeah. <laughs> Shoot, yeah. Y'all all right with being on video? Or I don't care. Okay, yeah. all right, cool. So I say I can edit it out, man. I, <laughs> I won't be out here too much longer anyway. I'm just having some fun. Pretty quiet for such a big old hole in the end of this thing. <laughs> I wasn't sure how it was actually going to sound being a 45 can, but I'm I'm liking it.
This is the first time I haven't ever had to tighten this damn can up on my gun. <laughs> This is pretty dang fun, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. That's, it's long. I could shorten it up to be that short, but why? You know, I mean, if you're gonna. It's pretty slick, it's running. Hope you don't mind us sharing with you. I'll go for it, buddy. Were you, were, will your metal target handle a nine fine? Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, I shoot the shit out of it with everything, man. That's normally what I shoot. This is the first time I've shot 22s in probably six or seven years, I guess. Yes, sir. What's going on, buddy? Not much. Who are you up to? Out playing. Yeah, I actually thought you were out here yesterday. Oh, yeah? I hearing was ting, ting, ting. And I thought, <laughs> oh, shoot. No, it wasn't me. This is a, a Mark IV uh, Ruger 22. It's a light. And yeah. it's got, I've got my Jim Tech Lunar can on it. Oh, that's light, too. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty quiet. You want to shoot it? No. Here. No, I'm, I'm good. I Go actually, uh, maybe in a second. All uh, right. My daughter, she's shooting a 22 for the first time. Oh yeah? Oh, yeah. that's cool, man. Got her a, uh, a Rossi 22. Heck yeah. And uh, also, well, so I like the full size, but the, uh, uh, I got it with a red dot. Oh yeah. So Bass Pro's got a deal right now, $1,000 for the 509 tack with a red dot, but I don't buy ba guns from Bass Pro. Right. So I went to Fort Chaffee Outfitters. Hell yeah. Hell <laughs> yeah, man. But, uh, that's the way to do it. Hell yeah. <laughs> All right, well, uh, I'm gonna go over here and shoot some razzles. Shoot. Before we're done, I'll, 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 I'll that yeah, yeah. I'll be over here for a little bit. I'm not gonna be much longer, man, but uh, if I'm fixing to head out and y'all are over there, I'll come over there and let you shoot it. Oh, yeah? Yep. I had one of those Volcorts and Scorpions in 22 mag. Well, that's pretty slick, man. Heck yeah. Well, compensator, that thumb ledge is pretty nice. Yeah, but that would be, yeah, that's pretty quick. And man. feel the trigger on that. Yeah. What kind of trigger did you put in it? Wilk Scorton. Here, I'll just run one mine if you want, man. Uh, that way back. you don't have to waste your ammo. Is it got a Wilk Scorton trigger? Yeah. Oh, that's slick, dude. Yeah, I got it down. <coughs> it's about two pounds. My, uh, my one on the scorpion on that 22 mag was like i think it was a pound and a quarter but i mean at 100 i had it rested and i was shooting just a just a regular quarter <laughs> it's like i mean it but i had a pretty good size scope on it but yeah that's slick man that feels really good with that thumb yeah sport. one thing it doesn't have irons it's just got the dot boy that that trigger is light man <laughs> I wasn't ready for that that first time. Trying to figure out where it's hitting. Looks like you're... Is it high? I think so. There yep. we go. Oh, that's slick, dude. I like that. <laughs> I like that a lot. You gotta see some long range stuff we play <laughs> Yeah, most of my long range stuff I don't put on YouTube. I, <laughs> I leave that alone. I I have my little toys that I bring out here and some stuff I I hide. <laughs> you know, this thing's running pretty good. I didn't even lube this damn thing. I got out here and I thought, you know, I didn't even oil it.
Capri Sun. Drink the champions right here, buddies. Pretty day, so. Excuse me, buddy. Wanna give it a shot? So you want to give it a shot? All right. That's super weird. Can't put this thing on safe unless I recock it. Okay, so. Huh. I don't know how you're doing that. I think maybe you're going too slow. I don't know. I don't know. That's weird. I haven't seen that before. That's pretty strange. Yeah. There you go. Oh. Yes. I brought a couple rounds. Um, nah, you'll be no, good. You, you're only going to hear ting, ting, ting. Yeah, it'll be. I mean, it's it's not super, super quiet, but it's. Here, here's another one. That's a. Those are uh, just standard velocity ammo. It's not a lot of difference, but there's some. That was the top one. I gotta get one of these. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, they're pretty awesome, dude. They're pretty awesome. Huh? If you get one, can you? That's quiet. Yeah. Can I let her shoot one? Oh yeah, y'all can shoot as much as you want, man. So here you go. Here. Lay this finger down on these under. Boom, boom. There you go. Now bring your other hand up. Raise this thumb up. Bring this thumb around. Just like that. So with this thumb, take it off safe. Bring it out. Not straight arms, slightly bent, lean forward at the hip. And the same thing. Huh? No, no, you want to spread your legs, lean forward at the hip. There you go, lean into it. So line the top of this straight across there. And then aim just to the right. Like aim at the pole. Go and squeeze the trigger when you're ready. There you go. There you go. She's a natural, man. She's a natural. Not bad. You are just to, well, I think you're on, for my saying, you're I think you're just to the right and a little high. So aim to the pole, to just to the right side of the big circle. There you go. I did it. Yeah, okay. Yeah. It, smells, it does smell kind of smoky, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Just got this thing. <laughs> yeah. There you go. There you go. She's a natural, man. Yeah. Whoa. Most of them have been ricocheting in that barn. That one actually took off. Yeah, if you throw some 147s or 150, something like that, yeah. and they're already subsonic. And that's what you're hearing right now is the crack off yeah. of it, you know, it dropping down. But, uh, and on this one, you can actually take these two baffles out and have it that short. How much was that? Uh, do you I think it was like $8.99. That's not bad. No, it's really not. <laughs> that one actually went in, I think. Uh, nice. No, nope, I just didn't throw it out. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty slick. Man. I left the empty, uh, empty round in the chamber.
You made a fall. But all right, buddy. That was good seeing you. Likewise, glad y'all. Glad y'all got to shoot it, man. Yeah. She's yeah. a good shot, man. Y'all have a good one.